when we understand the meaning of the word calm correctly. It will answer a question that has been lingering in my mind for a hundred years, the castle was built by the calms. Inscribed with calm characters and is in calm language something we've suspected for a long time. Where has calm gone? Now we have the answer that calm has not gone anywhere. It is still spoken continuously in the three southern northeastern provinces and provinces along the border. Hello. I present information truthfully. It does not refer to French data. Map of the vast Khmer Empire that has deceived the world for a long time it will be completely gone. Claiming that the Khmer Empire was vast and vast it was actually the Kham Empire. The French probably knew that the castles in Siam and Cambodia were built by the Khams. I've never heard the French say that Angkor Wat and Bayan in Angkor Thom were built by the Khmers. But in order to take control of Cambodia therefore, it must be claimed that it is a castle built by the ancient Khmers. Including the inscriptions, it is called ancient Khmer inscriptions France doesn't say it was built by the Khams. Because if you say that it was built by the Khom people it is not convenient to separate this area from Siam. So they tried to advertise that the Khmers were great and that Siam had previously belonged to the Khmers. Everything is an advertisement. But it was effective in part because many academics believed in this story. France separated part of the territory from Siamese rule. Another way is to try to remove the word calm from Siam. This has caused Siamese and Thai people to ask each other, where have the calms gone? Makes you understand that calm is a culture. Makes Siamese people understand that unable to determine what kind of person calm is. Trying to erase the word calm out of the perception of Siamese people. Causing the next generation to talk about Khmer loan words in the Thai language. Even though the truth is that it is calm a request in the Thai language that has been used for a long time. It's time for a change. We paid a stupid price. I've been giving it to France for a long time. Today I'll tell you just this. I will tell you a new story on another occasion. For today, goodbye.